Hello, parents of 7D. Uh, the newsletter has just come out, so I thought I would read it to you instead of sending it to you. Dear caretakers of Year 7 students, this is Mr. Bjornbody, head of Year 7, talking. Due to the circumstances concerning the coronavirus, we have not been able to have an assembly in the Aula, and we haven't yet evaluated the year-level goals we set up last assembly. However, things are going in the right direction, from my perspective. In mentor time, we've been talking about things concerning our groups, trying to keep up with individual talks as much as possible. We are now in the final part of the school year. And I'm asking us all to focus on the academics. We encourage your children to make an extra push to reach their goals. Make sure to check Schoolsoft for notices concerning your child. We will now start the process of class remixing for next year together with the student care team, mentors, teachers, management. All students will be asked to submit two names of preferred future classmates. This will be taken into consideration, but no promises will be made. All right, and the, last, the rest of the newsletter is just important dates, and I'll put that in the email. Uh, Mr. Bjornbadi signs off. What I would like to mention is that in 7D, there, there's probably about six kids who kind of take a, up a lot of space socially and verbally. Um, and then, you know, some kids who are kind of in the middle and then a, a rather big group of kids who say nothing almost ever in class. Uh, they just don't want to get attention. Um, and if you know your child to be like that in school, obviously no, no problem from a behavior perspective. Uh, and we have introverts and extroverts and, and every vert in between, but uh, just remind them that they have valuable things to say and that I want to hear what they have to say. Obviously they should raise their hands, but uh, we want their contribution. I want their, their confidence to grow always. Easier said than done, but maybe you could just encourage them to uh, put themselves out there a bit more. If you know that your child tends to talk a lot, maybe just remind them to make space for others or to bring out the opinions of others instead of just putting out their opinions all the time. <laughs> I love them all, but yeah, can be annoying. So anyway. Uh, final stretch. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Enjoy the coming of spring. <laughs>